Welcome back to our channel. It's hey. been a while. Hi. Today's vlog, we are going to do a Yema cake. Yeah, steam. Cake. It's a steam Yema cake. Steam Yema cake. Yes, it's going to be yummy. How are you? We've been out for a while because of the yeah. COVID. Yes. COVID. I hope you guys are staying safe and staying at home. Stay the at best home. thing to do is stay at home. Don't yes. go anywhere. Just stay at home. Wash your hands. The whole coronavirus your hands. thing is going crazy. Yes. And bake some cake. Bake some cake. cake. <laughs> All Let's right. go. Let's go. Okay, so we are going to make, we're going to do the, the dry ingredients first for the cake mix. So we have one and one fourth cup cake flour. Sift. One and one fourth. One fourth. Okay. Okay, right. and then we're gonna need half tablespoon of baking powder. Half a tablespoon of baking powder. There's our half tablespoon of baking powder. Yes. Okay, should be good. Alright. And a then half teaspoon of salt. Half teaspoon of salt again. Half teaspoon of salt. Half a teaspoon of salt. Is that half? Oh, half a teaspoon of salt. That's it. And then half sure. cup sugar. That's that's all for dry. Half cup. Oh, ingredients. Sure. So, there you go. Oh, that's all. Alright, let's zip. Okay, we're gonna zip it. Same thing that we did yesterday. That's smart. Why do you have to put it in there? So that they can mix easily. Oh. Alright. Then okay. you mix it. Can I borrow that? Yeah. All right. And then mix this. Mix it thoroughly. That's it. All right. So this That's is it. the dry ingredients. We're gonna set this aside, and then we're now, gonna do now is the wet, wet ingredients. Wet ingredients. All right. Let's start with the wet ingredients. What do we need? We need eggs. six start egg, yolks. With eggs. egg yolks. Six egg yolks. Yeah, hand it to me. You have to separate the egg white from the yolk. This is how you do it. Crack it. Transfer it. Transfer it one more time. Transfer it another time, one more time. And there's your egg yolk. Okay, that's one. You gotta be That's, that's what we use for the meringue. Oh. We set the, like the white, oil. egg white, set it aside for the meringue. Alright. Next. Next ingredient. Next ingredient is half a teaspoon of cream of tartar. 
Fuck. We're doing the. We're not doing the meringue. <laughs> we're doing. Oh, sorry. <laughs> All right. What's next for our wet for ingredients? For the wet ingredients, next is one fourth cup oil. Yeah, one fourth cup of cooking oil. Notice is that one fourth. Yes, yeah. one fourth. Yeah, that's one. Fourth cooking device. Okay. One fourth cup water. All right. Let's grab some water in our water dispenser here. You can use evaporated milk or you you can also use fresh milk if you want. Alright, how much we need? One fourth. One fourth cup of eva evaporated milk. I like evaporated milk better than the fresh okay. milk. Okay. There you go. I just noticed there's a lot of mat, like some mat in cooking. All right. Let's All right. go. Next, beat it. Yes. Mix them together. Mix it. Okay, that's it. We're good. And then guys, we're gonna put the wet and the dry together. What? Have we done this before? Well, like we didn't do it on it. Okay, just mix it. Mix the wet and the dry together. It's pretty easy, huh? Easy as one, two, three. <laughs> okay. So for the meringue, guys, we need four egg whites, half teaspoon cream of tartar. Okay. And then one fourth cup sugar. All right, then we gotta beat it until it's foamy. Fire it up. We push. Four. Six. Okay, our meringue is almost done. Okay guys, so now we're gonna put the meringue together with our cake mix. We're just, we're just gonna fold it, Cut we're not gonna fold. mix it, okay, we're gonna fold our meringue. Wait, let me do it.
That's it. That's it. That's good. All right. Now we transfer our cake mixture in our baking pan. Okie dokie. So we're gonna put it on our steamer. Set in low heat. Right. Put it on to, we put it on boil. Now set it on low heat and steam it for 30 minutes. Okay guys, so what we're gonna do now is the Yema frosting. Just one and a half. So I have here the four egg yolks. I have separated the whites and the yolks already. Okay. And then we're gonna need one tablespoon of be okay. corn starch. You know what? I'm gonna need um here. A little bit more. That would be good. So one tablespoon corn starch. And then we are also gonna need half can of half of these evap evaporated milk. So half. Mm. I think that's half. No, yeah, that not, no. Uh, we that's used good. some earlier for the. I think that's good, huh? Yeah, for the cake mixture. Okay, that's no, good. A little bit more, okay. And then one can condensed milk. Condensed milk. Of Nestle cream <coughs> if you guys using the big one the big can of Nestle cream use half of it vanilla half this is one okay guys so I'm done mixing it all together so I'm going to cook it now All right, next for the icing. For this. The fire settings on low and we're just gonna keep on steering this. All right. Okay guys, it's done. We'll just put it on the side and let it cool. 
before we put it on our cake is also done okay okay now our cake is done we're gonna cut it in the middle cut it in the middle I hope it's in the middle. Alright, that's it folks. Then we're gonna transfer it here. That's alright. Just put that on there first and transfer this one here. I can actually use this spatula now. Put it right there. Our bread life, and now our. Put it like that, feeling. Put it back. Okay. Let's put some on top. Okay. <laughs> and then let's put some cheese on top. go guys Let's just put it in the fridge chill it a little bit and it'll be ready there you go see you on our next vlog thank you so much bye